bought up the ton of overall matches last week in Lao Toka, but not a result to celebrate. We have seen slow starts by the champions in the past, but this year has been uncharacteristically wobbly. Toppled by the Chiefs at home, bounced back against the Highlanders. Kids night, of course, plenty of young people around, and also members of the 2003 championship winning Blues team. So Richie Moonga it will be to set the match alight. Kick off down to the 22. And one of the outstanding performers of this blue side through the opening three rounds, Hoskins Satutu to Tuivasa Shek. It wasn't a great pass. Right at the face. Papali'i wins the lineup. Blues advance it. Crusaders tried to sack it, but they didn't get it right. Barrett. And so under advantage, the Blues look to move it to Lea coming into the midfield bouncing out of tackles and breaking Mark Talia he's going to have Moana on steps inside him Talia uh -huh. oh what a try outstanding Mark Talia puts the Blues in front oh gee is a what how did he break those tackles we've seen all that already in this season he wasn't quite there from the Blues but the strength, the determination, fights out of a couple of tackles, breaks through, there's a bit of a hole there for him. He looks up and backs himself one-on-one. Wonga -on -one. tries to get into the touchline, but how about that? Straight outstanding try. Now that's a brilliant try from Talia. There were 15 defenders beaten going into the match. Add another three, maybe four. Look at the pace, the acceleration, then bang, I'm gonna go on the outside, then the late step, and the power, the upper body power, Ethan Blackhead just couldn't hold on. Well, the Blues have had set-piece opportunity and it's taken, well, from 40 metres out to get over the line. Well, one thing players have to learn about this fella here, if you don't get him early, chips at Goldwood and a nice strike from Bowden Barrett and the Blues lead it by 5-0, to 7-0. to nil. Tackle made by Sewer 4. A little juggle, then taken ahead by Cody Taylor, and they come back to the left. Ball out the back door. This is opening up nicely for the Crusaders, and they're in. It's Fergus Burke. Well, they've just stacked out to this left-hand side as well. They look so organised, coming in waves. The Crusaders after some really good carry. Blackadder now. Trying to step his way back and then offload. Gets it away nicely to Drummond. Wide they go, Fanga and look who slips the tackle of Telia. Oh, good cut down tackle made though by Roger Tuivasa Shek. Really starting to stress this Blues defense now, the Crusaders. Moonga. Now Enor gets a lovely ball away. Reese. Tops it up to Drummond. He has a look, offloads it away. Black at her. Crusaders in front. No one more deserving than Ethan Black at her. Some of the carries that he's had to do in close quarters. He's been physical, he's been strong. And the work we're at so far, just over 20 minutes, has been immense. Blues just can't keep it. This man there, Sebi Reese, he's one of them. The two incisions from him. This is brilliant from Drummond. Drummond has been there. Right at the base of each row. And this one is over. Well, Sam Barry joins us. Sam. Right, they're hard to stop when they get a roll going. What's the key to it from the Blues' perspective? Um, I, I think if we can just stay connected on defence, um, you know, I think we're, we're bringing good line speed, but we've got to come together because obviously they've got such, such good threats across the field. Um, so I think if we can do that moving forward, it'd be great. Just wait and see what happens from this movement here, Sam. We'll get you to hang on. Nice, oh, nice catch and run from Cameron Sewer 4. Gets the ball almost down to the five. The referee blows the penalty. And it's taken quickly by Finley Christie. Clark for the line. He's over. <laughs> Come on, mate. Give us a smile there, Sam. They've got to be better than that. Okay, let's let's have your summary of it. 
take a look at the big screen and see what what do you tell us sam well he's never going to die wondering finley christie and a powerful finish striking the ball nicely here so far tonight here's the attempted conversion and then it's over that's two out of two from the tee well, not, well initially it was taken by burke but he's lost it to leah just needs to get his bearings right he was heading back towards his own goal line there for a moment but the blues get it back lalala -la -la out the back door pedal feta barrett now putting a chip out towards the wing bounce will be interesting but severus has got it and he's lost it so it's back in the hands of the Blues, and driving forward is Caleb Clark. And this is what the Blues want. Lalala, steaming into a big gap, the big man, trundling it down towards the 22. Christie's there, now Barrett, holding it up. Satutu inside the 22, breaking through the tackle of Christie. You don't see that very often, and he's hurt the open side for the Crusaders. But the Blues spin it wide. Tui Vasa set, stepping, oh what a try! What is this game turning into? How important is a momentum swing? It just gave the Blues enough opportunity to go back, reset themselves. It's got into rhythm, here it is. He couldn't believe it, the big man, what am I gonna do? Does an excellent job to take the tackle and recycle. Nice little restructure here from the Blues. The back four. Rico Yohani does really well because he straightens up the last minute. The feed's coming across. Tui Vasa. The line running is outstanding as you see Barrett add the other two. But the line's from Nepo La La La. The line's from Tui Vasa Shek. Rico Yohani. By Drummond. Another offload from Black at it. Christie doing well. And now the Crusaders are just 20 metres away from the line. Cody Taylor. Oh, nicely done by McLeod, stepping away from the oncoming defence, and Fang Anuku has a stroll in at the corner. Then they just go into some nice bit of structure out the back. Tuivasa Shiki has to come out of line. Nice border finish here. Fang Anuku over in the corner. I don't know whether Akira Ioani's trying to put him off. It hasn't worked. That's a great conversion from the sideline. McLeod cut down just short. It's there for the Crusaders. Can't get it over the line, though. Real pile up on the line. The referee's got the hand out. He's going to have a look. And he's been good tonight, straightening up the attack after we've seen Sibu Reese over and over. He got oh so close. It's a great cover tackle. Peter Feta and then Joe Moody. Actually, I'm just starting. I'll, I'll take that back. I'm not sure if, if they've got no replacements available yeah then surely we have to go to an uncontested yeah, scrum that will be fairly big line break would be this player Chose. has a foot hand on the ball the whole time do right there so on the yeah. penalty cynical not rolling i thought there would have been a penalty try he's going to give a yellow card then if it's cynical so Fines. finley christie Fine is going to have five. to pack down on the back of the scrum Six. hit in nine hit sort in. of well, they go away to the left the pass flung wide, buying up and look who's got another one. Easy as. And, and the smart. Crusaders are back in front. And smart stuff too. Sorry, TJ. From the Crusaders. He got touched in the end, but it was a brilliant pass from his inside. As on the sideline. Lovely pass from Fergus Berg. And well finished by Fanga Anuku. Now straightening it up nicely, Tucker, that's another great move. Now Talia spots a bit of a hole, off he goes. Satutu is with him, where's the support? Oh, lovely ball away. Great tackle made by Moong, and that's another try saver. Yeah, ball's out. Finley Christie, they managed to scramble it away through Satutu. Now Talia, well, the Blues against the odds now. Threatening the Crusaders' defence. Christie bounces back to the left. Oh, good tackle made by McLeod on Dalton Puffle. But it's still there for the Blues. Barrett gets rid of it. Now Barrett gets a nice ball away to Rico Ioana, who stopped just five metres short of the line. Well, discipline from the Crusaders is good. 
And now they've got it and stolen it. See there? Oh, the crowd's not happy. Can't quite figure out how that turnover came. Now Richie Morgan kicks out towards the wing. This could be really dangerous. Tui Vasashek gets to it. No, he doesn't. Fonga Anuku's got it. Fonga Anuku end to end. That's a killer for the Blues. And a massive blow struck by the Crusaders. Oh, you mentioned an absolute killer, all right. But it came from the counter arc from the Crusaders, five metres out. And this is the threat you have when you're two men in. The bin. A field kick from Wangi. This is the turnover here. Whitelock got across. Yeah, he was the one that counter ruck. They got Riccatelli. Bit of space. The key that it found a bit of space, but he got a lucky bounce too. The fight for the ball was all fighting on Nuku. Then he showed a bit of pace and a bit of power too. Finishes it off. What a try. Well, there are three key moments through this. There was the Richie Mawanga cover tackle which snuffed out the try, then the turnover from Whitelock, and then the Richie Mawanga kick will actually make that four with this man, and still a lot of work to do. His big, strong right fend and his pace to finish off, well, the blue. The now to spot the opportunity, the precision with the kick, and now the conversion to cap it off. Another good tackle made by McLeod, who's had an excellent game. Now straightening his heen, breaking to his heen. Springer trying to bring him to ground. He's got him inside the 22. Robinson picks it up and makes further ground. Christie, pop back on the inside by Barrett. And heen carrying it to the five. Yeah, he's got, I think it's Christie for not rolling away here. And now offside. Christie looks to the left. Tucker. Good tackle made by Enor, but they can't stop Perifeta. It's a try to the Blues. Well, they were under penalty advantage here, the Crusaders. Uh, the Blues, I should say. They've cashed in with a try that keeps their hopes alive. Oh, here we go. Blues fans are happy. Perifeta, he steps up. Nice little pop on the inside to Tucker. That's what I like about the Blues, they're finding little wee gaps in there. Big hole there, separation. Crusaders conceding the try when they were under double penalty advantage. And the kick is over. They're a team that know how to cherish possession. Good move by Christie, getting the ball up over halfway. And now the pick and go through the middle. Talitui it was. Ball's been lost in there. Coming back on the blue side. And now, well, they've been scoring in multiples of five and seven tonight, but this time the Crusaders go for the penalty. He's been doing it tough tonight. But he's come up with his usual tremendous performance. Oh, that's a great follow-up to the kickoff by Kurt Eklund. Ball loose. And coming back on the blue side. And they'll get the scrum feed. For Christie, Tucker. Advantage, 17. Another advantage against the Crusaders. They're starting to add up inside the 22. Bouncing out of tackles is Zahn Sullivan. Picking and going is Rico Ioane. He stopped just five short. Barrett now drops it onto the boot. Tucker's the man chasing it. Patafilo put into touch. Back for the penalty. Opportunity. Tucker does well. Rolls up the sleeve, there it is, the arm around, around him, not releasing it. 17 there has kept his hand on the ball the whole time, so it's yellow card. Well, man, born in Ruatoria, who went to St Kent Island. here. Now, Satutu trying to go right through the middle of them. It's there still for the Blues. Robinson peels away. Eklund driving towards the goal line. They pop up Christie Tucker. Boy, if anyone deserved to try it, he's got it. Chance for the Blues now to go in front. The ball has been knocked on in goal. Okay. okay. No, no try. try. Goal line dropout. Plus four. And of course, it's a goal line dropout. Now Gallagher. No, he's okay. Richie Moonga. For a moment, he didn't look too good. Now the ball's been lost, 
And it's a penalty to the Blues. On the ground, Westford and the ground. Oh, and now, yeah, Tom Christie's just gone in there and wrapped the ball up, knowing there was a penalty advantage. The kick from Barrett out to the wing. Oh, oh. what a try! Oh, Huskinson 2-2! for the original decision of playing it back. Wait yeah, for the so crowd. Guys, it's been clearly lost. No try. He has to regather it. No advantage. We've been here before. That didn't look too straight. It wasn't. Oh, just another twist in the tail. <laughs> Dishes it off to Haim. Manages to get a knee on the ground, does he? No, oh, he says he's held up. He went in upright. It'll be a turnover. It's all over. What a game. Drama at every turn. Some controversy and some quite spectacular rugby. But in the end, the Crusaders find their champion qualities to hold out the Blues and win it by 34 to 28.